Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here, another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to resolve that Google Chrome is not working or responding on your computer. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward tutorial, guys. And without further ado, let's jump right into it. So obviously, you can just uninstall and reinstall Google Chrome, which I would recommend doing if this tutorial does not work for you. However, I wouldn't give up hope yet or at least that that easily so we're going to go about trying to resolve it without resorting to that quite yet and we're going to start by opening up the start menu type in chrome best match should say google chrome you want to right click on it and select open file location so you see there's a shortcut that it directs us to you want to right click on it and then select open file location now it should highlight a chrome right here you want to right click on it select rename you want to add a dot after it so just type a dot after chrome like a period dot whatever you want to call it hit enter on your keyboard now you want to right click on it and select create shortcut and you will need to create it on the desktop so select yes and now also if you had a shortcut down in your taskbar I would suggest right clicking on it as well and then unpin it from the taskbar. And now we're going to right click on this Chrome and then period or die, whatever you want to call it, in our folder here. Right click on it and select pin to taskbar. And then we're just going to drag it wherever we want it. And now we also want to rename the shortcut on our desktop here. If we had one perhaps previously, we're going to go right click on it and select rename. We're going to call it Google Chrome and just hit enter and that's pretty much it guys so everything links back to this application so if you do the shortcut back in our start menu so let's just say we close out of there typed in chrome we right clicked on it you see it does say google chrome and then you select open file location you see the shortcut still says google chrome and then if we right clicked on that and then selected open file location it takes us to this so just to show you guys that Google Chrome still works with the shortcut that I made. I'm just going to show you guys here. Should work no problem. Again, you know, you can get rid of that um, other taskbar icon we created here and then we could pin this new one. I've noticed that sometimes, so you might have to just pin this new one. So we're going to pin that one to the taskbar. Close it here. And then if we open up the taskbar icon now, just to show you guys that this one works as well. Works perfectly fine. So, again, pretty straightforward tutorial, guys. Do hope that I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.